got together, myself and a buddy that also I brought out of the Marines, and he works here as well. I uh, got together and decided, you know what, we've always kind of wanted to see a little bit more of the country because we've deployed away from it so much. And we had a couple bottles of wine and said, hey, what do you think about walking across the United States? And I think the other guy said, yeah, why not? And once you make a commitment like that, it's a promise. And we kind of got together and said there was a certain window of opportunity here, especially for weather uh, across all 12 of those states. How are you guys today? Good, yourself? Good, good. How's the trip? Almost over. Yeah. And also because we're really ramping up our search and recovery operations and putting our international teams back out. So this was the perfect window between June and now kind of home by Christmas uh, between Boston, Massachusetts and Newport, Oregon, which is uh, just right up the road. Uh, me and my buddies, uh, we're, we're all former Marines that served together in Hawaii and we're walking across the country to raise awareness to the recovery of the nation's missing in action. I'm the nephew of Marine Corporal Clarence Stanley Hodson, who was killed in the Battle of Tarawa in World War II. I find the cross of my uncle, Clarence Stanley Hodson. <clears throat> and I don't get through this story without tearing up a little bit. I didn't know the crosses existed, but one had been found and turned by uh, History Flight by Justin LeHue and uh, was donated to the National Museum of the Marine Corps. I'm a member of the Oregon Mounted Governor's Guard. There's 15 of us from around the state of Oregon. We uh, mostly do parades throughout the summer and escort dignitaries, and these guys as far as I'm concerned, are dignitaries. Well, we call it the long road for a reason. It's definitely been long, uh, doing thousands of miles across the country. I saw a sign for Newport for the first time yesterday after a little over six months, and that was, that was a really good feeling uh, and a really surreal feeling that we've covered 3,365 miles by foot. A lot of people drive it. A few people ride their bikes across it. Nobody walks across it. Highway 20, and it's been an honor to be able to be some of the first people to ever do that. It's been an amazing experience to see the country, to see America, to see the people, to meet other people, share stories, but do this uh, to, to raise awareness that they're still missing in action um, in, in other countries that we haven't recovered yet.